What up, chosen ones? It's G Wells with them, and them are you, which are the chosen ones, and I'm chosen to serve the chosen ones. Look here, chosen ones. Today's market is an experience market, a market where you're allowed to create your desires, create your experience and create the things you want in your life. And you do this through imaginary activities, imagining your desired end, imagining and creating what you see for yourself. And it's through these imaginary activities that they will be brought forth through physical manifestation where you can now objectively experience was what was once imaginary. But all too often we can't hold to the faith, hold to the faith that what we desire, what we want, for our lives, for ourselves, it's already done. We can't hold to that faith. And you can't go the distance with the desire. You can't go the distance because it's going to be some shit that come up in your life that's going to be totally opposite of what the fuck you really want. And it's going to crush you. And it's going to make you feel like what you desire or what you want, it's not even real. It's impossible. It can't be done. And that you should just fall back in line like everybody else. The world sees it. It happens every day. And you'll go back to your old ways and give up, and give up on the new path, on the new journey. See, it's easy to look around and see what everybody else is doing. Look what everybody else is doing. They all getting the same results. They all getting the same results. And you jump back in there thinking you're going to get different results. No, you stay on your path. You stay on your journey. Regardless of whatever you got to go through, you got to realize whatever you're going through, it's just shaping you to be prepared and be able to occupy what it is you want. You got to live through the trying times. And when you come out on the other end, you will have the blessings. You will have the manifestations. But it's a... It's a, it's, a, it's a different type of market now. It's an experience market. You, guess, you just can't talk about it now because things have gotten so crazy in this world where you can't, you can't fake it. You can't fake it. You can't fake it. You can't fake being happy no more like that. You can't fake being peaceful. You can't fake none of that shit no more because it's so crazy out here. The world is just so much crazy. It's like... You can't fake it. So you have to do the work that is required to actually get there, to get the experience of peace, of bliss, joy, and happiness, because it's so fucked up out here. You can't fake being happy. You feel me? You really have to be happy if you want to experience that. You can't get by by just faking. It's just too much going on. It's too much shit, fucking shit going on in the world. It's too much news. It's too much social media. It's too much, like, all this shit. Too much pop shows too much you know like it's just too much of too much you know what i'm saying too much reality tv that shit ain't real it ain't enough real out here so you can't fake being you can't fake being happy you can't fake being at peace you can't fake being real and it's like if that's the things you really desire you really have to put the work in so you can't fake it no more
Because this this is what the times have called for. These are the times we in. It's too much going on in the government. You can't fake it. It's too much going on in the economy on a on a money level. You know what I'm saying? The stock market. It's too much going on for you to fake it now. It's, it's hard for you to fake it. Cause so many areas in in everyone's life is being hit. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta truly put that work in to experience happiness, experience the things you want to do in life and be. Because without God, you ain't got nothing. Like that's how I be feeling. Like if I ain't got, like I ain't, if I ain't had God or I was my purpose or like just my stability and God, like dog. I'll be out here like everybody else, bro. I'll be out here tripping. I'll be out here, you know what I'm saying? Selling my morals, selling my soul for dollars, man. Doing whatever for dollars. Putting money before purpose. That's like putting bullshit before business. What are you doing? Putting money, money over purpose. Are you, are you crazy? But it's, it's hard to fake it. So you really got to put that work in if you really trying to, you know what I'm saying? That's why this, hey, listen. Many are called, but only a few are chosen. Everybody ain't going to be built for it. So I'm going to start off real strong. They first little little hiccup, they done. You know what I'm saying? Then you're going to have some that's going to get to us, get, get all the way to the middle and don't see, you know, the benefits that they think they should see. And they're going to turn back around. I once was that person. Listen, I got, I got in there and I jumped back out into the matrix. I was like, damn, it's crazy. I got, I got on my path. I had it going, but I gave up. Went back into the world. So don't be that person. Be the one that goes all the way to the finish line. Keep going. Keep whatever. I don't care what it look like. Just keep going, dog. Keep going. It'll work out for you. Keep going. But you got to keep, keep going. Because it's an experience market. And you gonna, you gonna, you gonna, everybody want an experience of God. This is your experience of God. This is gonna be your experience. You wanna experience God in this. When you, when you imagine your desire in, and you live from the end, and you walk, talk, think and believe from the from from the end as what you want is already done and when that thing start manifesting in your life it starts showing up then uh you know through the you know number of events it take for it to show up physically you're gonna find peace you're gonna find joy in that because you're gonna be like damn i'm on the right path it ain't here yet but damn, it feel good to get those signs, synchronicities, and get that confirmation and, and, and celebrate myself and pat myself on the back for them small W's. You feel me? Them small wins. You ain't always got to wait for the big package to come. Celebrate them small wins. Celebrate them small wins. Celebrate them times when you step outside your comfort zone and make a decision in a way that you don't normally make it. Celebrate them milestones. But you're gonna have to put that work in know what it is. G. Wells Widow. Yep.
that's it.